so you know <laughs> this is something that uh, I need to say today particularly to our amazing men and women you know don't rush to get married don't rush nothing if you have rushed to start up a business to start up you know a career to start up one thing to another don't rush to start up a marriage it's not something that you will rush because if you go to prison today and you check the the rate of prisoners you come to understand that majority of prisoners today their children mo most of them not all uh, if, uh, i don't want to say all because if i say all that means uh, i'm trying to fake it but most of them are being brought up by single fathers and single what single mothers go and calculate it go and check the calculation you come to understand what i'm telling you is true because when i was at home my mom, my dad and my mom never raised their hand on me but the reason why i'm always scared to make mistake is that anytime my father is around i don't know that kind of spirit that always make me become so scared that i always comfort myself and anytime my mom is around i don't know that spirit they carry that i am always comfortable to laugh to smile to know that i don't laugh with my dad i do but when my mom is maybe my mom sent me message i said ah, i don't want to go whenever my dad come in you got to understand that 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 this that character nobody will force me or tell me to hide it i will be the one that will hide it by all mist by myself i will be the one that will hide it by myself without even you know without even calling or seeking for what for nothing so why am i saying this is that many of us today we are not able to figure out the danger of raising a kid alone we are not able to figure out the danger of bringing up a child alone because there is nothing that is so dangerous than to bring up a child into this world and later on you figure out that you know you bring out people who rest either in jail forever that is just like you giving them a life that they don't deserve yes trust me because there is a way that a father will talk to his, his son he will listen and there is a way that a mother will consult a son they will listen because uh, when i was in school there is one of my friend whom their dad their divorce they are not together so this girl do used to tell me that she don't fear her mom that if her mom slap her she will slap her mom back and i was so annoyed and i like this girl because she is so intelligent so brilliant and all those stuff i said why will you have this mentality towards your mother whereby you live with your mother he said because i don't have father with caring you have saying i don't have that father caring and i was shocked i said what is really going on why will you have this mentality someone that take good care of you and you don't fear her and she said there was a day that her mom hold her to slap her she hold her mom this one is not that she is joking if you see her you will know what she can do so that is why we need to understand that rushing into marriage and at the end you marry someone that you don't fit in or you can't stay for forever with my my sister is better not to get married it's better even to be a baby mama that that is just the fact it's better to be a baby mama and live with your partner well than to do or than to live that kind of life trust me because uh, some people we said uh, what you are saying is not good is this but that is just the fact truth go and check the rate of prisoners in the world today you come to understand that many of them are being raised by single fathers and single mothers go and check it this may sound what bad and rude but that is just the fact truth 
That this is something that we need to to do or to be careful when when we want to involve in marriage. Don't rush anything. Don't let someone tell you, ah, you are getting to 40, 50, you are not yet married. Ah, there is no children, no kid, nothing. My, my sister, it is better to do it, to live a single life than to bring out, to, to, to bring children into this world and give them the life that they will live to the end of their own and regret it forever. Trust me. Because the reason why many of us today are living this life because we are just we are just in rush. You know, I have one of my friends whom I visited when I was in when I visited Africa. I was talking with her. I said, "How come you you um, you get pregnant so fast? It's not up to one year that I just travel. You just get pregnant." She said, uh, "Because." Uh, the man is just a mistake. Uh, then my family forced me to marry or to marry him. I said, wow, that is good. That is good. But do you love the man? She opened up my, her mouth and told me, I don't love her. I'm even planning to divorce to, or to divorce him. I don't love him. I mean to say, I'm even planning to divorce him. What does that tell you? Imagine if that kind of lady divorced that man with that bitterness in her. How do you think she will be able to withstand and oh, she will have the courage to be giving the children opportunity to meet their father in order for them to have that father love. It's impossible. So that is why we need to do what we need to watch. That is why we need to be careful because this may sound bad and rude. This may sound no, 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 no um, maybe uh, something not great. But the truth is that, think about it. If you are a man, you marry a girl, who never have that father love within. It's very, very difficult for you to give him that father love. Because it's not their fault. Because they never have their experience. They never know how to maintain it. They never know what it takes to, to be a father or to have a father. It's not their fault. But the truth is that there is a danger towards it. There is a danger. There is a danger 